this video you will learn how to create component dynamically in react so here we have component one component two these components are not fixed data they are dynamically created so let's have a look again here we have the component called dynamic component right and we have the prop also from the prop we have the title and also the content so they are not fixed data they are not fixed value it get the value from the parent component here is the app component all right so we have the component data basically this is the array of objects in this case we have two objects so we have the object one object two with the component one and two and for the content we just write as content for component one and content for component two down here we are looping through this array of objects so dot map and we have the data right so we just gonna loop it one by one okay each object at a time and right here we are using or we are calling the dynamic component all right so we have the key and this is the data itself so we use the three dot data meaning that we get the information from this whole object okay one at a time so when it loop the second time then it will grab the value from here so now we have the data right and here it's just gonna show whatever data that we have in the component data here right so the first one here would be dot title okay so dot title referring to the component one and the dot content here this is referring to the content for component one so once it finished looping the first one then it will do the same for the second one that's why we see component one and component two and of course you can add more data right here okay so let's just say this is number three and four the same for this one three and four so once i saved it and now you can see this component is dynamic so we dynamically create this component okay it is not fixed value so yep that's pretty much for this tutorial it's a very quick one and i hope you learn from this video and i'll see you guys in the next video